BB Stew Buddies, this is Fetters Farmstead. My name's Tyler. We have plenty of stuff to do today, so let's get after it. So today is a little bit of a dreary fall day. Not really, we're on the tail end of August here, so we are in the transitional period here in central Pennsylvania. So uh, Black Betty is this close to giving birth. So we gotta get her maternity ward together get some bedding in for her some uh, wood chips in the mud hole there that is obviously right at the gate where I have to walk so we got plenty to do let's get after it but first we got to give mr. beef a good morning good morning beef how you doing pig y'all by yourself we I put this poly fence up around the, the big old tree here. Give beef a, a way from all the girls. So he's in his little bachelor pad right now, living his best life. Ain't hey, beefer. Ain't hey, beef. Kiss the camera, buddy. Kiss the camera. And Sarah has started making a pot of pot pie for supper tonight. She'll make too much and have to give half of it away. But that's that's usually how we go. So, gotta get the wood chip. Look at this mud pit back, Betty. We gotta get rid of it. Do you mind if we do? I'm gonna put some wood chips down back, Betty. At least two loads. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get some of these guys fed. Ginger and Black Betty are starving to death. So we're gonna get some feed out here and take care of them before I go get my next load of wood chips. Are you hungry, beef? Hey, beefer. Gotta get your dish away from the fence. Here you go, beef. Good stuff, paint bud. Good stuff. You ready, guys? Goats and dogs. Goats and dogs. No cows, no pigs. Goats and dogs. No cows. You ready, cow? Here's your breakfast. You're next, June bug. Come on, goats. Come on, girls. Good girl, Luna. Come on, Lola. Okay, barn chores are done. Sarah's heading in the house, strain milk, and I gotta go feed feeder pigs. No pumpkin patch. These guys are fed now. That don't take long. I'm gonna go haul some more mulch, and probably by the time I'm done with that, haul a couple loads, it'll be lunchtime. Well, all done with chores. We had lunch. Sarah made some ham sliders with leftover ham we had for supper Sunday night. So now we gotta go run some errands, go to the accountant, do some stuff there. Spend a bunch of money. Uh, we were at the accountant for way too long. But we got everything done. 
we were waiting five months on our last accountant to get our taxes done for the year it took this one a week and she actually talked to us and explained things it is wonderful to have an accountant that you can actually talk to and you know converse with so I feel I feel like a load of stress is relieved oh oh well I gotta go make a phone call and then figure out some things what to do yet I'm running out of time I got an hour until I gotta leave again all right I just got off the phone no go she's busy so we'll talk to the bank some other time so Sarah's making Popeye noodles you want to see how to make good old-fashioned Pennsylvania Dutch Popeye noodles? So what do you need, Sarah? What do you need, Sarah? Bunch of flour, you just throw throw as much as you want in a pot? Yep. It's all about a feel thing. So what do you add? You add salt, vinegar, flour, salt, eggs, egg, and water. Flour, salt, egg, and water. Now Sarah, I don't know if she learned it from her grandmother, but she takes after my grandmother and she don't measure nothing. Just a little bit of that, a little bit of that, and done. Makes it good. A lot of this, a lot of love. Right, Sarah? Yep. A little bit of love goes a long way. Some fresh farm brown eggs. How many? Yeah. Make sure there's no red spots, speckles. Don't get your shells in. Man, you're an old pro. And then some water. Splitch it everywhere. That's fine. Going for a consistency thing, not. Just work it into a dough. And you gotta roll it out. Roll it out real good. Now, Grandma always used a paring knife, but Sarah's gonna use a pizza roller because that's quick and easy, too. And it's okay to be rustic and have all different sizes, <laughs> it don't bother nobody. Does it? No, not really. Then when your your uh, soup starts boiling, don't have to be a crazy boil, but boiling, just start putting your noodles in. Mix it up. Make sure nothing sticks. Sarah obviously uh, had too much for the first pot, so she had to get a second pot and divide it up a little bit. I told you she'd make too much. That's okay. Her. Her dad will get some, her uncle will get some, I'll get some. Well, we're out of time. Time to get in the truck and go out on the road again. Work, 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 never ends. Back again, home again, home again. All right, I think I'm gonna mow grass. Grass seeds mowed pretty bad. So instead of hauling more wood chips, I'm gonna mow grass until supper. Then I'm gonna go eat some ham pot pie. You want to grass, buddy? Huh, buddy? All right, let's go mow grass. We're almost done with mowing. Got a couple more things to do, but Sarah says it's supper time, so we're gonna go eat supper. See what. Uh, What's good? I know it's ham Popeye, so the, the excitement is not really there, but you know. Hey, Boo, you ready to go eat supper? We mowed the field, we mowed the yard. Mmm, pot pie. And Sarah does not skimp on the ham. When I was a kid growing up, Dad always made no ham, ham Popeye. He was so chintzy on the, the ham. On the meat, the good stuff. Well, quick supper. It was delicious. It tasted better than it looked. 
So I'm gonna go finish mowing and then we'll end up doing chores and that'll be the end of the day. Time for bed. Everything's mowed. Time for chores. Beef's already lined up to get his afternoon scratches. <laughs> evening scratches. Hey Beef, you want an evening scratch, buddy? You're a cute pig. Mabel's in a mood. Mm -hmm. Are you in a mood, Mabel's? Marbles! Mm -hmm. Are you in a fighting mood? Are you in a fighting mood, Marbles? Here you go, Black Betty. You got hay in your hut. You ready, Black Betty? Babe, get off my fence. Get off my fence. You two are the hardest pigs we have on equipment. You wreck my fences. You push your way through. Fancy. Fancy pig. That's going to be it. See you, love you, bye. See you in the wash. See you on the sunny side.